Alliance won in the red bumpers is up one. One more win and they move on to the semis. Blue needs a win to stay alive. Let's meet our teams. First up in red, they seem to have a new addition to their driver station thanks to 1126. It's 5406. Celtic. In the middle, the Alliance captain is 1126. Sparks. And rounding out this Alliance is 1559. Devil Tech. Down here on the blue side, we've got 26-14. Mars! In the middle, the captain's 57-40. The Trojanators! And rounding out this alliance is 35-04. Girls of Steel! All right, let's get this going. Drivers behind the line. Three, two, one, go! And they're off as 26-14 moves forward in the autonomous period. Are they going to make a shot? And they do. It's up and in. 15-59, 11-26, and 54-06 all cross the outer works of the Blue Alliance as the autonomous period comes to a close. 57-40 on top of the Girls of Steel at the beginning of the teleoperated period. And she, they throw them off. Everybody seems to be no too worse for the wear. 5740 trying to deliver a boulder down low, and they do. Fifteen fifty-nine already trying to play some defense in their own courtyard. 5406 crossing the moat the second time. And that defense is now damaged for the Blue Alliance. We got one defense damage for the Red Alliance as well now, too. And a heavy collision from 26-14 and 54-06 in the neutral zone. 26-14 on the rock wall crooked. They can't get all the way over. All the actions in the neutral zone or the Red Alliance courtyard. And here comes 54-06 flying underneath the low bar with a boulder. Address for the Blue Alliance Tower. They're all by themselves. Can they get it in there? But here comes 5740. The boulder's good and a heavy collision between the Red and Blue Alliance in the Blue Alliance Courtyard. We got some heavy defense playing right here. 1559 bumping Mars as they try to shoot another boulder into the Red Alliance Tower. This is a heavy hitting match number two. The Blue Alliance needs to pull out a win to stay alive, and it is neck and neck. Two defenses down for the Red Alliance. Three defenses down for the Blue Alliance. 15-59 in a pushing match with Mars. And here comes 57-40 through the neutral zone. Another boulder courtesy of 54-06 in the Blue Alliance Tower. Both outer works are still standing, but 54-06 trying to put an end to it. And there it goes. The Blue Alliance outer works have been breached. Red Alliance only has one defense left before they're breached. And the Girls of Steel trying to put an end to it. And they even it up. Girls of Steel have breached the Red Alliance Outer Works with just 20 seconds left to go. It's going to come down to the end game challenge. 15 seconds left. Blue Alliance lining up all to challenge. Red Alliance all in a position to challenge. This one's neck and neck. It's going to come down to the wire by the skin of their teeth, by the threads of their bumpers with two, one... Match number two, here come the scores. Red Alliance wins with 102. Blue Alliance, 99. Red Al the number one ranked seed Red Alliance has won two matches now, so we will all say goodbye and give an extra round of applause for Alliance 8, 57 40, 26 14, and 35 04. Let's all give a round of applause to Alliance number eight, Mars. The Trojanators and the Girls of Steel. Excellent job, teams. And that means.